Sunday. It's been two weeks since I've done a live workout, so that means that it's time for another kettlebell live workout. Where we're keeping the workouts between 10 to 15 minutes long. Today's workout is exactly 10 minutes long, and I hope that you give it a shot. Um, this is a little redo, modified variation of what I have recently done at our Fit Ones Weekly Live kettlebell class. So we're gonna shorten it down just a little bit, and hopefully, you're gonna get a great workout in. Actually, I know you're gonna get a great workout in, especially if you try to do it rep for rep with me for the next 10 minutes. So a little heads up, I'm gonna be using a 35 pound kettlebell today. Um, use whatever you have available to you, but something that's also gonna challenge you a little bit, but where you can keep your form really solid. The key to anything with kettlebells is making sure that you have your core, or your core, your form down packed before you get started to make sure that you A, have a good workout, but most importantly, you don't set yourself up for injury. So listen to your body, choose the weight that's right for you. I wanted to go a little bit heavier today, but I am super sore, guys. We did something called Train Like an Athlete on Saturday, which we do every Saturday with my group of training friends. But by the end of the workout, I had done 60 pull-ups, and I have not done that in a really long time. So yeah, I'm on a struggle bus a little bit today. But you know what, it's recovery day. After I do this 10 minute workout, I get to put my feet up, just hit the work at the computer today, and let my body relax. I'm also a little bit nervous because I destroyed my hands at kettlebells this week. So yeah, all in all, it's gonna be a great workout, right? It's gonna be fantastic. All right, so what we got going on? 10 minutes on the timer, as many rounds as we can get through. We're gonna do 10 alternating kettlebell push-ups. So you're gonna have your hand on a kettlebell. We're gonna do a push-up on this side, and then a push-up on this side. Back and forth for 10 reps. Then we're gonna go into what's called 10 swing to goblet squats. Air condition just came on, boom. Where you're going to go straight from a swing. You're going to catch it in a goblet, squat down, throw it back into your swing. So it's a really big ballistic movement, but it's fun. So we're gonna start in our swing position, swing, catch, squat, up, throw back out, catch, back into it. So that's 10 of those. Then we're gonna go into 10 alternating clean and presses, pretty self-explanatory. So clean, press, switch to the other hand, clean, press. And our last movement, we are going to pop it up into goblet, and we're gonna go into a prisoner. So we're gonna lunge back, back, holding our kettlebell here, we're gonna go into 10 hip extensions. So we're gonna sit on our feet, squeezing our butts to stand back up and come back down. For 10 of those, then we're gonna stand up out of that prisoner squat and start back with our push-up. Whew, so yeah, that's the plan today. So grab your kettlebells if you're gonna do this with me. If you're gonna do it later, that's fine too, um, but just make sure that you push hard. Still, I'd recommend, even if you're gonna do it later, Come back, hit the play button, and try to keep it up. If you like this workout, or you like this style of video, and you're enjoying me doing these each and every other Sunday, make sure that you subscribe. Make sure you go ahead and hit that like button before we get started. That's the ticket to actually seeing the workout. <laughs> and then, I appreciate you guys so much. I really do. I really love doing these, and I hope that you guys do too. I like, hope that you like doing them so much. You're like, hey, how can I train with Kendall more often? Oh. I can do this live with her every weekday, Monday through Friday? You sure can. FitWomensWeeklyLive.com. I'll make sure to link it up in the description below once I get home. All right. Whew. Let's pray to the gods up above that I do not rip my hands. <laughs> and let's do this. Let's see what's going to be the best way. Let me move this back a little bit. All right. Push-up time. In five, four, three, two, one, go. One, other side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven.
two. Oh, shoulders are sore. Three. Four. Come on, use those hips. Power. Six. Strong stance. Seven.
What do you think of these? One. Two.